About 1.6 million rail cars are rolling around on the North American rail system, and the wear and tear of heavy railroad service takes its toll on them. Car shops are tasked with inspecting and repairing these rail cars, and at the heart of the action are the skilled carmen who perform a variety of tasks, from routine checks to complete overhauls. We torch, we weld, we bring all sorts of cars in, we fix up everything that we need to. We also lift some of the car's ends and uh, change out some of the wheels. Uh, you probably spend a little bit of time on uh, patching our hoppers, spend a little bit of time on light repair. You dabble a little bit with heavy repair, which would be like changing sills out on ends of cars and uh, the big stuff, wreck damage. and. Average day is mostly air brakes, but I do do a little bit of Carmen work. It's actually fairly simple when you boil it down. It's just air pumping through pipes into valves. We're looking to make sure that there's minimal to no air leaks. And during a test, we're making sure that the valves are functioning properly. The brakes are applying the brake shoes to the wheels tightly, and then they release as well so they don't get hung up going down the rail. When I first started, I did a lot of heavy repair stuff as far as changing sills out on cars, rebuilding ends of cars, taking gondola ends off and rebuilding them and making new ones. Rail car repair can require a variety of skills, from simple nuts and bolts to complex torching and welding. What's a good skill set to have coming into this job? I think you can come from any background, honestly. I came from a personal training background and a metal cutter, but it would help if you have a mechanical mindset. They'll show you the ropes on uh, torching for a while and uh, they'll show you all the different parts and everything you need to know about a car. A little bit of welding knowledge, a little bit of torching, everything else we can really work with. The car shop is a towering, uninsulated structure with overhead cranes doing heavy lifting and sparks flying. What's it like working in that environment? Cold in the winter, hot right now as we have the record heat, but as long as you stay positive, your attitude means the most here, so. Uh, just showing your uh, worth, showing that you're interested in that more or less. Just uh, proving yourself, coming in here and doing your job. I feel proud to come in here because I can always look ahead to management. I don't feel stressed out having to go up to any one of them. Leadership's great. They really bring some dignity to this job. I tell you, we got a great group of guys down here. All around a great group of guys. I get along with everybody here. I think people are great. They work hard. We have a good camaraderie. We joke around with each other, but still get work done. The Wheeling in Lake Erie offers a benefits package unique to the industry. What are those benefits? Benefits are fantastic. Railroad retirement's a big one. It's a huge one. Deductibles on our health insurance. Also, we have a 401k with company match up to 4%. And the extra things like every six months you go injury free, you get a dinner. They'll take the whole car shop out to a lunch and we'll get some extra lunch time. Train rides, I mean Santa train, who does stuff like that for their employees anymore? Behind every rail car rolling across North America is a carman who made sure it's safe, sound, and ready for service. It's hands-on work that requires skill, focus, and a good work ethic. With every weld, every inspection, and every repair, they help carry the freight that moves our economy one rail car at a time.